Hey everybody, what's going on? Shabby Do here, and today we're gonna take another shabby peek over at Moonglow Bay. But I wanted to show you something real quick. When I logged in today, they put the keyboard controls up, which is awesome. I remember I started with the keyboard and then I immediately switched because it was awful because there were no tool tips. There were nothing to really help with the keyboard. So I love the improvements they're putting into this game because this game was not originally intended for PC. It's a it's a port, and I believe it was on the Switch, so is that's where the main release was and then they put it to steam so it's great that they're putting in all the effort to actually like make this a pc game as well i love it so i just want to show everyone that let me just confirm out of this not oh you gotta cl click over here for me let's get back into the game where we last left off <clears throat> so we need to start getting some money we need to start better utilizing our time here i've got four clams and the question I have is, what do I have? It's been a minute since I looked at this. I've got some tons of fish. I've got tons of um, minuscule mite bugs. So we'll turn that into bait. I've got some fish cakes as well. So let me go make some bait. We're going to make some dishes. And then we'll go take a look at our journal here as well. So renovate the library. Um, update. Oh, just invest in town renovations. That's just an ongoing thing. Uh, despite all the requests for repairs, the locals nearby, the town bulletin is always filled with assignments. Yeah, so we need to go do three assignments. So that'll be our main task for the day. Monster Moon Glow. We'll go figure that out as well. And we got to go investigate the tower. I mean, I got so many things here. Oh, hide completed now. Okay, there we go. Perfect. <clears throat> and then I need to get uh, Paris two white bellies. And we got to collect trash from the bay. So we'll get all that started. But first, let's go make some bait. I'll show you the process. It's really nice. This is what the mite bugs are used for. And you can do other things as well. Um, low grade. You can make high grade bait with medium fish. But I need to buy a meat cleaver first. So that'll be on a big to-do list as well. But if I grab, you know, four of these at a time. I wish we could do a little bit more in bulk. Especially for the bait. But if I grab my bait from the fish. And then I go in here and we do a choppy and a choppy. We get 12... 12 low grade bait so we'll uh fuck oh cook again so i'll do this we'll keep going we'll use up all of our bait here i'll make some food and then we'll go out and do some selling all right we made all of our bait i made some extra fish cakes too i didn't use all the fish because i wasn't sure i couldn't remember what we turned in either so i'm just gonna put all of our fish cakes in here because they're at like a plus 39 percent right now what day oh it's kind of late let's go to bed We'll actually go to bed for once it says i'm tired too i don't know how detrimental that is to us so kind of figure that out there we go so betty bye let's set the alarm for a.m well that's nice Like that little bit of music right there. That was lovely. That was absolutely lovely. Oh, got 184. Did they all sell? <gasps> Did we figure out what to do, everybody? Oh, baby. All right. So we load it up before bed and then we go to bed, wake up and we got all our cash holies. Easy game. All right. First, I got to go see uh, my buddy, buddy Paris. I don't know where Paris is, though. Help. I'm stuck. Um, I wish objective what's out there probably um picking up trash is out there that's a, a miss there so um library objectives i'm gonna assume over here ish let me check my journal again oops oh i lost the things i guess those were due yesterday so i don't need to get the fish okay they must have just been really quick ones i thought they were like two or three days but we are on day five i've been kind of goofing around a lot so let's get some cash here today Let's, uh, let's, let's do something. So I need to do three of these. So favorites of the day, the ocean overlord. Fish cakes are still up 14%. So if I go cleaner shrimp, I don't have any of these. And I don't know if I have a steamed fish. I don't even know what that is, honestly. All right. You know what? So we're not going to do bulletin boards today. Let's go clean the ocean and we'll go check out perching isles. Yep, clean the ocean, perching isles. All right, let's do it. Let's head to our ship, and we'll get a little bit of a... Uh, get a good deed done today. Clean up our ocean, and then I think over at the perching isles is where we're, like, checking to see where 
the whale is that everyone's um, all perturbed about. I'm gonna put my my um, my spinner on. I use low grade bait. I got 42 of that, so. Question is, where is the trash? I bet it's just all over the place, honestly. Let's just head to the perching aisles and we'll see trash on the way, I'm sure. Yeah, the streets. Oh, like maybe that right there, a little bit of driftwood. I mean, I wouldn't really count that as trash, but. Yoink. Got it. I wonder if I can use that for something. A lot of driftwood. Mm -hmm. This must be it, the tower. Elvis wasn't wrong. I can see something glistening down there. Great. Let's get fishing. I guess I got to fish this up. That's a weird way to do it, but I'm okay with that. Did I get it? I got it. Cool. I guess that's how that works. The net would have made more sense, but I'll take it. You got a fantastic. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of this angling malarkey. Let's see. Pink, waxy. It's got to be part of the ruin. All right, let's show Marina at the aquarium. She's bound to know more. All right, to the aquarium we go, and I'll pick up some trash olies on the way here. Got it. Whatever this is, it looks... I'm thinking seaweed, but... It also isn't really trash. Kelp. Keep it. Ask updated. I guess that's trash. All right, let's head to the shore here, because I should be, like, right next to it. Yeah. I'm going to take this steamed fish one right here. I know what this one is now. I looked at the recipes as I was taking a walk. Hopefully I can do this before he like disappears. So going back home, I just need any fish and some seasoning. So the reason I didn't see it in my list before being able to do it was because I was broke. And get out of my trash, Cooney. Got the boy. Good boy. Yeah, that's a good boy. All right, so if I come over here, cook, and I'll see steamed fish right here. So any fish, and then I needed five clams. So I'll use a, I'll use a white belly. That's a pretty common thing. Cook it up. So let's do it together, right? Little choppies. Beautiful. Fry it up. Then we got to get the fish now, because that was just the seasoning. We're going to wash it. Always wash your fish. Always wash your fish. Boop, boop, boop. And then we're going to boil it, because it's steamed. And steaming and boiling is obviously the same thing, okay? Okay. We're just boiling the water that's beneath our steam basket, okay? That's really what I'm doing here. All right, so we got our steamed fish. So what do I make of this? Fascinating. It, uh, I, I'm this is continuing the main quest here. So it's a great part, monster part. They all spooked. Yeah, which one, right? It's whale skin, likely from a barnacle whale, but it's mixed with limestone and steel wire. Poor thing. A barnyard, a barnacle ra whale, extremely rare, normally docile, unusual migration pattern. Feeds on cod, very common in the bay, and retreats to crevices when threatened. But I've never heard of it attacking ships. Must be terrified or enchanted. A joke. Uh, there must be a cove nearby, a refuge where it feels safe. Somewhere with pink limestone likely inaccessible above water. Hopefully that helps. Um, so that means... The rock is actually whale skin, contains just a limestone. She's just researched for a particular cove. It's not going to be in these frozen areas, so it's going to be like this way. Lonely Rock. Um, I would honestly think it's like down this way, maybe. Oh, it's probably right there. <laughs> I forgot the game, even though it doesn't like tell you where to go. It still puts markers on the map. Who are you? How do I wait? How do I get up there? Something here. Oh, wait, are you who I want? You are. <laughs> Oh, you saw my note. How'd you how did you get it on? Give him an item. Uh, steamed fish. Just one of them. Submit. Oh, oh you're an absolute lifesaver for you. The reward. Thank you. That was 150 clam always. Thank you, boss. What's this? Hey, you're not going to let me up here. Come on. Don't, don't you play me like this. 
Oh, you rat little bastard. Oh, I got it. I don't know what. I don't know what happened there, but I I figured it out. So this is uh, not accessible at this time. I don't know if I was supposed to really be here, but so that's the clock tower cliff. So that's cool. Follow this over here. Uh huh. Here's the real way I should have gone, and my doggy made it. Good boy. Good boogie. A good boogie. All right, we're gonna go find this whale, and we are going to do whatever we have to do with that whale and pick up some trash along the way as well. Another piece of trash here, a little bit more driftwood. That should be three now. Just making my way out to our little whale friend. But I thought I was gonna get like barged there. Ooh, what's this? Gotcha. What are you? Give me that glass bottle. Message in a bottle? Water bottle. Just a water bottle. Keep it. Water sea. Getting close to our whale friend here. Oh. Pink limestone. This must be the cove. We'll need help clearing a path. Doesn't Abby have a winch? Right. Oh, radio her the coordinates now. Good thing I bought that radio. I wonder if it would have told me I had to go buy the radio. Or maybe, no, the radio was part of the main quest. So, no, never mind. Ooh, ready to toe. So, what's behind there? Sharp red bass, Atlantic cod. Possibly a whale. Uh, what? You barely graduated fish line fishing and now you're hunting the ruin? Relax. I've done my research. I know what I'm doing. I asked a couple Facebook friends about the ins and outs out here. So I've done my research. We're good. Okay. Uh, Everyone says that right before everything goes wrong. You, Richard, Casey, what are you trying to prove? That I'm not afraid of a whale to move on. I mean, look at my face. I'm old. Okay. I got, I don't got much longer. Just let me do my thing. <laughs> You're your worst, worst enemy, shabby do, but fine. Yeah, that's pretty true. That's pretty true. Can't get out of my own way. God, I thought she was just gonna like explode. Oh, so it just sunk at all. Okay, cool. I love it. Really loving this game. If you guys are too, hit that like button down below and let me know what you're thinking too. And if you are new here, do hit that subscribe button as well. It really helps out and make sure that you're part of that famous under a thousand crew because we're almost there. Whaley. Good old whale, where are you? Um, uh, must be over here. What's that? I wonder if I can fish that up. There he is. Oh, he's beautiful. Ain't she a beaut? Oh, Steve Irwin would be so proud of us right now. All right, so, yep, I do have to fish this off of it. Oh, so it's just like fishing, fishing. Is that tension? Okay, hold on, so there's tension. fine it's fine i know what i'm doing now we're ready for this gotcha baby you break my boat to hit my boat girl you got two more harpoons i ain't done with you he did break my boat look i got a phone call to make hey shabby dude you need a tow back it'll cost 43 clams yeah i guess I guess my boat was broken. I had thought about that before, but I didn't even think about checking in for repairs while I was in town, honestly. A boat shop. Hey, baby girl. Oh. What are you after? Um, what's all this? Quick repair. Men's superficial. Um, full repair. Yeah. Just one. Yeah, okay, there we go. Full repair. Oh, that looks better. Yeah, we were definitely hurting when I left that. All right, let's head back out there. Uh, excuse you. Nope, nope. Can I? Nope. Hey, give me that back. 
I'm not close enough. Hold on. Ooh, I got a lobster. All right, throw that back in there. Some bait in. Boom. I'm going to throw one over here. Put some bait in. Boom. I'm going to just put them all out here. That one didn't have bait. That'll be a test. Bait. Bait. And that's it. Okay, I had only bought five before. All right, cool. Those will be there. Here he is. Here he is. So. Gotcha. Gotcha, baby whale. Don't you worry. Everything gonna be all right. Every little thing is gonna be... Oh, up. Wait, up. X. Okay, so... It's giving you Xbox controls. Well, maybe not Xbox controls. Maybe they're Wii controls. I don't. I don't. I don't play Switch a lot, so I, it could be the Wii as well. Because that was actually Square. Because I'm using a PlayStation controller. Ooh, hey, little thing. Is that a part of my boat from before? Grab it. I can't see, but I'm just going to assume I got it and just reel that in. I just move my camera and not be stupid too. Is that a tire? Why is it square? Oh, my tires are square too on my boat. It is a tire. Okay, yeah, keep it. All right, let, let's go. Oh, nope, nope. This. Got to get that last harpoon off our boy here. Come on, where you at, baby girl? There you are. All right, we'll take good care of you. I'm going to stay a little further away from you, though. You're you're pretty moody. Can I reach that one? No, I'm a little too far. Gotcha. X. B. Yeah, Xbox controls. I didn't... Oh, it was showing a down arrow. I didn't see that. I thought... Huh. Okay. I'm ready now. I didn't see what, what the control was there. I messed that up. X. X. Down X. I gotcha, baby. I'm here to help. Be free, friend. Just don't don't mess up my boat again. Like, come on, be cool. Be cool. All right, we got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. Oh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> Screenshot. Is it saying thank you? Can fish say thank you? It's a mammal, Dan. And of course they can. And as soon as Moonglow sees the whale's true colors, no one in town could possibly feel intimidated. Sailors will be back on the water in no time. You'll see. All in a day's work. What now? Now I ought to make amends with Abby. She's probably worried sick. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of fishing in here. And I'll obviously uh, cue you all in if we find anything good. But first, I got to see. Can I can I reel this thing in like I did with that other stuff? No. Okay. What about the net? Nope. Okay. Cool. Nothing. So first, I'm just gonna I'm just checking to see if there's any more trash here for me to pick up. I don't know what kind of good picking up trash does in the game besides um, that one main quest, but you know we'll see. I'll still pick it all up. Good for the environment that way. It's what you should all be doing. All right, so yeah, like I said, I'm gonna do some fishing out here. See what kind of new fish we get. Chin cutter, that's new. There's another new one. We got the cowled darter. That looks pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. I love the fish in this game. It's really fun. Hope there's a way for me to know where I'm missing fish later in the game. So it's not like I'm out there. Ooh, a blazing inker. That looks pretty cool too. Yeah, so that went 83 kilos. That's massive. That's ridiculous. Uh, yeah, like I was saying, so that way I know where I'm missing fish because we got 100% it, right? Like, if you guys are loving it, we got to catch every fish. It just doesn't make sense not to. 
new record on that one. 130 kilos. Ridiculous. So here's another new one here. We got a wise minion. I changed my rod up to see if we get some new fish, and we did. Ooh, there's a new species. So we just netted some of these in. Oh, I've got two, the Acadian redfish and the red drum. So I had left the hitting cove, and I went to the border sea, which is just outside it, just to see... Um, what was going on for fish out here and do a little bit of night fishing here too. I wasn't getting any more new catches in the hidden area, so obviously maybe I need some high quality bait to maybe catch some extra secret fish out there, but we'll see. Oh, another blazing anchor. I accidentally released those, god damn it. It it's it's very odd how they have like the confirm button for a lot of things as circle, but it's the release button when fishing. All right, so net fishing is pretty OP here. I just, they, it keeps respawning, so I'm getting like, ooh, look at that. Oh, I've had these before? I don't know, I think that might be... I don't think I've had one of these before. A Notre Dame Sand Digger, though. I wonder if that's a, if it's either, a, it looks like a crustacean. Keep them all. But like, as I did that, they all respawn, so they respawn pretty quickly. Do a, do a round of fishing, though. Yeah, see, they're back already, so I can just, you know, come out here, do a little net fishing. Try and catch them all in one roll here. And there's five fish. Or five catches. Maybe they're not all fish. Ooh, crusted orbs, huh? That's new. I wonder, like, what kind of, like, barnacle stuff I'll get out of that. Or if it's... I wonder if... They're blue-bottomed. So I wonder if these are going to just be used for bait. Which is fine. I'm all, I'm all for bait. Okay. Oh, here's a new species. We got a couch potato. I just did another net fish. Ooh, and a baggy o, the jellyfish looking thing. Cool. Two other spots to get. Ooh, another new species. We got water babies and a moon eel. I'm gonna reposition the boat. Actually, ah, freaking Christ! I accidentally canceled it. There's a lot further than I needed to be, but that's okay. They just respawned. Just missed them. Ooh, new species of groundhog sea bug. <laughs> that's one of my favorites so far. Ooh, a little cutscene. What's happening here? Hi, Shabby. I'm sorry about before, for what I said. I miss Richard, that's all. And Casey. The ocean's taken so much. And I know what happened to Casey wasn't overconfidence or some curse. It was just a tragedy. Anyway, friends, always. I'll get out. Daughter in the background, like, ah, keep Dad, keeping friend. Excuse me, shabby, right? What's up, Kev? Well done. That creature's been a thorn in the side of every angler for miles around. Thanks. Oh, don't thank me yet. You're just, you've been making waves. Paris Lavoie would like a word. Ready? Petty Levy. You over here? Right, who's... Oh, we gotta go turn in our quest to our nice little child over here. Larry! You cleaned the bay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. We're best friends now. I have to make it official. Give me your book. Don't oh, you feel happy too? Sure, but like you said, we shouldn't need a reason to help the environment. Now you sound like a self righteous Saturday morning cartoon. It's true, you do. Not like a prick. Um, huh? Nine, she says, and three quarters. She'll go far. She'll go far, baby. All right, uh, that one's done. What is going on at the? Wait, what's this? What's... Oh, that's a door. I thought that was an exclamation mark. Like, what can I do here? Oh, this is Patty Levy. Ah, uh, shabby. Oh, shabby. Finally, now explain yourself. 
Excuse me. I said, explain yourself. What is the meaning of this? The whales, the fishing, the street food business. Is this a takeover? Where are you from? What are you trying to do? I think I've gone from like French to Russian to KGB. I uh, helped the town. That's all. Like Casey wanted. Casey? You're Casey's husband. Sorry. I'm not myself lately. Storm clowns put me on edge. Let me restart. I'm Petty Levy. I know it's not Levy. It's Lavoie, but Petty Levy just has a better ring to it in my mind. I mean, it's a sea market. Shabby doo. Fisher. I make waves. <laughs> little friendly advice. Get out of there. Meet people in business. People need to know who you are. I suggest starting with Sophie Nadeau, Billy Wilson, and William Bennett. They're the best anglers in town. They catch everything for the sea market. Now the ruins out of the now the ruin out of the way. We're gonna see some big changes, especially in these turbulent times. Speak to the anglers. Listen to their advice afterwards. The sea market should be up and running. Cool. So we got to go talk to three more people. And then we can get the sea market open, which would be cool. Maybe he's got like recipes or other like things for us to do. So let's go run out. Uh, you? Hello. Hi. Sophie. Ah, this is the amateur. The ruin of the ruin. The monster master. They got the mash. It was a graveyard smash. He did the mash. <coughs> Sophie Nadu. Understand you wish to learn the mysteries of advancing angling. As you know, changing your lure and bait will help you attract different species, but for that extra edge of reeling, let me tell you about the four rods, the four legendary pokey rods. All right, first you got balance, which we have. Balance is great all rounder and straightforward to use, if not exactly specialized. For some easy reach and leeway, you want the strong rod. Here, take mine. Ooh. Really? You sure? I insist in honor of bringing fishing back to the bay. Oh, they're each going to give me a rod. So we're going to get like strong, agile, and resilient something like that so like strong will be for the aggressive one striking is less demanding and fish need a greater distance to escape however striking is less effective and the overall real speed is slow it's great for a casual afternoon on the waves plus it reduces the initial line tension when re reeling resilient okay of course when you cast your line you won't know exactly which species you'll hook but don't worry there's no downsides to using any particular rod it's all about style and preference why don't you take your new rod for a spin? Catch three fish using the strong rod in the open chill. Perfect. Oh, and be careful out there. The waking storm is gathering strength. It might be worth investing in a reinforced hole if you're journeying out that way. In the meantime, I'll track down Felix. Come and find us what you cost those fish. Cool. All right, what else do we got here? I got something to do here. Oh, town board's right here. So, let's see. Boiled lobster. I could probably do that, actually. Um... I'll go check to see if I can do it first. Like jerk poutine, I don't even think I have that. So I'm cleaning a shrimp. So we'll see about jerk poutine and that stuff. Uh, what's going on back here? What's going on at the mayor's house? Hello? It says there's an objective. You know, I, I bet it's one of the like ongoing objectives here. Cozy cavern, complete request. It's the complete request thing, I believe. All right, we'll move on. What else do we got? Nothing else down there, but what I am going to do, let's go down to the museum and let's turn in all of our fish for the day. All right, so new, 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 new. Oops. What's the point of giving them two? Submit. Fantastic. I'm going to need more space. So, okay. Yeah, like all of these have... Okay, cool. So everything I've given her now. What, what, what do you got to say? Sorry, Marina. I haven't been able to cook your grilled octopus. I don't even have an octopus yet. Let's take a look around. Look at all the fish. We got some jellyfish in this case. So I've got, it looks like we got that bag of bows, the anchor, and the like standard jellyfish. We got some other stuff in here. Oh. Oh, I can examine it. Oh, it's so cool. Look at that thing. That thing is massive. That crazy little purple crustacean that we caught. Gross. What's downstairs? Nothing. It's it's blocked off by a rope. Okay. Very cool, though. Very cool. Can't wait to fill that whole museum up. <laughs> oh, no. Wait. I'm going to steal your dog. Excuse you. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're mine. What's going on back here? Is there something over there? Oh, is the chilled ocean over there? Yeah, it is. 
All right. So yeah, I'll round this day off. I'm going to do uh cook up a storm over here. Well, I'll get all my fish ready, get a bunch in the market and then kind of just go around. I got to do more board quests, but I'll see if I can do a boiled lobster, but I don't think I can do jerk fish poutine or cleaner shrimp because I don't have shrimp. So I know I can't do that one. The jerk fish poutine will be another question. Oh, so now I'm wait, what the hell? I've never just passed out from being sleepy like this. Oh, I just got sleepy. That was weird. I'll take a nap too. Well, we'll make sure to go to bed. We did stay up all night. I think the last time that came, that like debuff came up, we were out in the ocean. So that's why we didn't notice any change. But yeah, guys, like I said, if you're loving Moonglow Bay, make sure you leave a like, like down below and do leave me a comment as well. Let me know what you think of the game so far. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well so you can get back here for that sweet shabby content. And as usual, hope the rest of your day is not too shabby.